Detecting deception is a challenging task. Joe Navarro. Some behaviors are universal. This is the body language and behavioral analysis of Robert Tellis. Robert Tellis, um, first name is Robert, R-O-B-E-R-T. Last name is Tellis, T-E-L-L-E-S. Hello, I'm Rob Tellis and I'm your Clark County Public Administrator. Um, I don't know if you notice uh, the height difference. Um, I, I wear lifts in my shoes. Uh, but I'm about six foot five and a half and... Uh, it is natural to raise both shoulders when we are uncertain. Raising one shoulder only while speaking indicates deception and evasiveness, as the body and the brain are not limbically committed to what's being said. And so, um, later as I continued to research, I found out that the only thing it was going to do is bump the search result up on my own browser. But thank you, sir. So I ended up finding I'm about six foot five and a half and uh, uh, five foot six and a half. I did lie. I call it a vanity thing, right? I just wanted to feel a little taller. Um, and when my, I guess, right off the bat, I'll share an opinion with you. Our lips may compress together, reflecting stress or anxiety to the point where the lips disappear. And that was pretty much so it's in very, third place so at, at all times. So it's very close, right? It, it was really close. You yeah. don't know how this, at this point, as of June 16th, you Covering the mouth indicates lack of commitment to the individual's own speech. The same occurs with eye blocking or delay in opening the eyes. Also known as see no evil, speak no evil. By referring to them over and over. And, you know, it, it was a lot. Um, then, then the... But it was, I mean, never, I'm not guilty, I didn't call Mr. German. Um, so, but as you can see, I... Anger is displayed by exposing the teeth, kind of like in a snarl. Chin jut, chewing or biting lips, nose flare, shaking head, sarcasm, sour lemon face. It was put on me that, that they just had a serendipitous benefit from that, that all these things that were coming to a head for them, just, it's done. Just, it's done. No repercussions, no nothing. So, you know, that, that's, I'll leave it to you, you know, to think about that. You didn't like Jeff Garman by this point, did you? I mean, I mean, by this point, did you? I mean, I mean, sure, I did not like him. You hated I mean, him, isn't that correct? And I don't know if, if hate, I mean, There might have been various points throughout that where I might have felt like that, but I don't know that I ever... He was not a central figure in my life. I, again, I don't blame him per se. I blame Rita and I blame Alicia. Sir, you just told this... And I blame Alicia. Sir, you just told this jury that if those articles weren't written, you those... believe... Hold on, Go ahead. not finished. The question is yes. Uh, who, I hold, who I hold most responsible is not Mr. German. Sir, that's not my question. Okay. At this point in time, isn't that right? I could not say whether I hated him by this point in time. Um, and if I, you know, how long I might have hated him, if, you know.
in your number, correct? No, that, it was not personal. Okay, uh, I didn't mean that. I, I meant, I apologize for my misstatement. Communications between you and Roberta, correct? Business related, yes. Right. And I know that I would prove I'm innocent at trial, but I don't want my, pain, my family to go through the pain. Um, Dine is done, so Sir, and if he goes on and does 10 more articles, same net effect. Right. right. I mean, reporters typically don't ask for records requests unless they're planning on doing a story request, unless they're planning on records requests, unless they're planning on doing a story, correct? Sometimes I think they're just fishing to see if there is a story. And what? Oh, let's talk about Zach. You like Zach, right? You know, you said you... Yeah. Sorry, Your Honor. I... You said you then came home, isn't that right? the articles per se it was obviously Rita and Alicia who got Jeff Gehrman into the fold to publicly tear you down and they did yes and he agreed they did, yes. And he agreed to do it. He agreed to do it. He agreed to do it. Yeah. 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 You would... Mr. Mogg would not have found videos for the second, for the third, for the fourth. Um, personally, I believe that when there's no videos for all those days, I'm not sure how Objection. it could be so... Sure, no problem. Of course, Your Honor. <clears throat> And I think my attorney has already kind of discussed with you the deletion of this body cam video. Well, let me show you. It's been marked as Exhibit 376, proposed Exhibit 376. How are you feeling about Jeff Gehrman's next upcoming article? I don't recall. Okay. Are you concerned at all? I don't recall. Okay. Robert Teus, um, first name is Robert, R-O-B-E-R-T, last name is Teus, T-E-L-L-E-S. Hello, I'm Rob Tellis and I'm your Clark County Public Administrator. Can anybody tell me who I hit? Who the hell did I hit? Hold them while I double Dude, did I hit? Why are you taking me from my friggin' house? Why do you, uh, do you have any suspicious... This is G2. <laughs> this is H2. This is I2. This is J2. So I, I found my wife sitting on the floor in our bedroom in the middle of this mess. And so this for me was, the, you know, the, the thing that just broke me. Um, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I knew I didn't do this thing. And 
yet the police claim to have this evidence. They did what they did to me. And I have a million dollar life insurance policy. I can't imagine the kind of person that would. Objection. Sustained. So I personally can't imagine myself to be the kind of person. Sustained. I am not the kind of person 